Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Thought I'd do something different in today's video. I'm going to be doing a makeup look and no, I never wear makeup, but I did get a new palette for my birthday, the Morphe 35B, and I feel like there's nothing else to do, so why not try and do some makeup? I'm currently in my sister's room because she's got a nice mirror. I don't have one of those. So yeah, just see what happens, I guess. Thought it would just be something fun to do. Let's get straight into it. Also, before we start, I'm just going to let everybody know that I don't use expensive makeup because obviously I don't wear it often, only if I go out. Drugstore makeup is just as good. But yeah, I'm going to start off with some primer. And the primer that I use is the Rimmel London Lasting Finish Primer. So honestly, just going to put a little bit of that. Okay, it's not coming out. There we go. Just a little bit on my hand. I'm going to take this new brush that I also got for my birthday. It's pretty cool. You can like... No, I don't think anyone really cares. This is pretty good practice for when I do actually go out and I have to do my own makeup. Well, it certainly happens because I do do quite a bit of modeling and for some reason the makeup artist can't come or emergencies. At least it'd be good on it. Kind of know how to do some makeup. For some reason my skin looks a lot smoother on camera than it does in real life because I'm telling you right now it looks pretty good. I think I'll start with the eyes in case there is a little bit of fallout. See, I do know a little bit of terminology. Oh, I've never used this. Oh my gosh, just look at that. That looks insanely pretty. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm really, really bad at makeup. So I don't know what to do. Please don't judge me. I always say that, but I really want a cat and there's really cute blue Persian kitten. They're so cute and I really, really want one. Somehow, I don't think we're gonna get them because my dad is totally against it. I've been making like little cat noises like, I'm so weird. But I just really want a little kitten during this time. I don't have concealer, but I do have foundation. I'm gonna use, I love this foundation by the way. If you are looking for a drugstore foundation, 100% use this. Rural London is like my fave drugstore brand. But yeah, I'm gonna put this on my eyes as like a face. Put a bit on. Oh my god, I just feel like a makeup guru right now. And then, of course, we have to set our eyelids. So I'm just going to go on with this powder. Set them. Otherwise, the eyeshadow ain't going to blend. My hair is um kind of annoying me at the moment, but it doesn't look too bad. All right, guys, I don't know what to do. I literally don't know. Oh, this is going to be so bad. I'm sorry. This might be a fail. Anyway, I'm going to go with my little e.l.f. blending brush. I think I'm going to go on with this color. I feel like it would be a good crease shade. I used to be really into makeup, that's why I do kind of know what, what I'm saying. Ooh. I'm changing brushes, this Morphe brush that I got because that one was not so awesome <clears> on <throat> my crease. Oh my god, I look like I have pink eye. You've got to trust the process, guys. <laughs> Gonna go in with a bit of a br more brownie shade, this one here, to make it not so intense. I'm not vibing at all how this looks. Now that that softened it a little bit, it doesn't look as bad. Now we're going to deepen the crease. This burgundy colour here, just, just a little bit um, on the outer corners, you know. People that are really good at makeup are going to watch this and they're going to be like, what is she doing? Without like any foundation or anything, it's obviously going to look bad. All I really need to do is put like a glitter or a shimmer in the lid. And I've got this really good compact brush from e.l.f. And I think I'm going to use um, this glitter, this like pink peachy glitter. Put a bit of that on my brush. It's very pigmented. I'm going to spray it with some Insta Fix and Go. Also by Rimmel London. It's just a thing that people do to make the colour stick on. Whoa! That colour though. Not that mad at it. it. Honestly, it looks like I just chucked a bunch of pink on my eye. Now we're gonna go in with foundation. Okay, it actually worked. See how instantly the eyeshadow just looks a little bit better. We love that for me. Again, with that Stralis powder to set our little faces with. Beautifully set. Next, we're gonna go in with bronzer, and I 
love this Emco Beauty bronzer. It's got like a bit of shimmers in it. Oh my god, I look like a clown. We're gonna take our highlighter brush, another Emco Beauty highlighting palette. We're gonna use a mix of these three shades. We're gonna put them on the high points of our cheek. And then what I like to do is I get that powder brush and I just kind of blend it all. Eyebrows! Fun fact, I do not fill my eyebrows in because I personally feel like I don't need to. They are quite dark. I'm just going to take a brush instead, brush them out. And then I go and put some gel and I use the L'Oreal Brow Plumping Gel. Just put a bit through and then brush them again. Okay, moving on to... Um, mascara. Actually, no. I saw this thing, it must have been on TikTok where you put your eyelashes on and then you put mascara. Look, I'm not gonna deny it. I cannot put eyelashes on, but I've got these really good eyelashes from BM Artist Lashes. And I have worn these before because I don't want to open a new packet and then just basically waste them. Scratch that, I'm fixing my eyeshadow first. I bought, before I went to Bali, Revlon Colorstay Gleaming Eyes, like liquid eyeshadow. And I just had this idea to make like a line, like on the crease. If it does fail, I'll just Put this over my whole lid. Let's see. Oh my god. I did it. I don't know if that looks bad. It looks horrible. No, it's not even bad. I'm gonna make this work. It honestly looks amazing. It looks horrible. It, horrible. it kind of failed, but at the same time didn't because it looks okay. Now we're gonna go on with the eyelashes. I have no idea how to put these on. I don't know how I just put that eyelash on, but um, I did somehow. She could put one on, but can she put two? She did it. Yeah! I'm so, so proud right now. They're not as dramatic as some people may like them. Marie, if you're watching this, I know you like a dramatic lash, but I just blend them. I honestly think I'm done. I've got lipstick. Wow. Oh, I really feel like a makeup influencer doing this. It's like literally burning already. This is the finished makeup look. I'm sorry that I'm not a professional makeup artist. Oh, also I did order a few things off Pretty Little Things. So a Pretty Little Thing haul is coming. I'm also gonna put a few winter clothing items that I ha already have from like other shops as well. Hopefully you all enjoyed today's video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.